So we're gonna try this again. It's been about five minutes and I totally cleared out the dash, had it on fresh air. Now, before I shut it off, I have it in recycle again, so we could capture, God dang it. So we can capture, um, any refrigerant that gets stuck in here. And I'm trying to do this so, uh, God, they got this thing all, everything is slippery as hell. They got armor all on here. So none of my stuff wants to stay in place. Ugh. There we go. Now, it's in high speed. That's an unfortunate thing. For some reason, I couldn't get it back into low speed. I was trying to do the ignition, turn it on, and it wouldn't go back into low speed. But, so I'll just turn on the ignition real fast. That'll make the fan move, and then I'll turn it back off. Oh, I'm picking up something already. There, there, let's see. Three, there we go. All right. Out of evaporator. Okay. So that's after I cleared out the car, turned it on to fresh air, blew out the case, made sure there was no refrigerant in there, then put it into recycle, shut it up for five minutes, and then what you just seen me do was just hit the ignition a little bit, and all the refrigerant that builds up from a slow leak inside the case just puffs out a little bit and the reason you turn the ignition right back off the fan right back off you just want the fan blade to start the roll just to push the concentrated refrigerant with a little air you don't want to over dilute dilute it with fresh air it's going to be taking in so we got a evaporator to go here and they could cancel that line that they ordered out there i'm pretty sure because what they thought was leaking refrigerant oil at a condenser fitting line turned out to be a power steering tube or our you know cooler line that was connected to um, the upper fitting on the condenser they actually use that junction point to connect their power steering that's where it's leaking and it's a pink oil not green uh, dye all right guys that's it for this one we'll see this one next time when they're doing a evaporator expansion valve and a desiccant bag and they could send back that hose that they got by accident all right, see you guys.